Hi there, I'd just like to talk to you for a minute about water filters. I've got a couple of different types here I'd like to share with you. This is the biggest of the brighter filters. Essentially it's just a jug kind of filter. It holds more, it's square shape, but it all relies on just one single activated carbon cartridge. And to be honest, all that it really does is give you better tasting water. You know, it takes, takes out some of the bad taste. But, you know, it's not that good. It's better than nothing, trust me. And if that's all you can afford, great. But look, for very little more money, you can actually get a beast like this. And this is really quite a good one. This is called the Aqua True, and it's based on reverse osmosis. In fact, there are three filters in here. Uh, there's a pre-filter that takes out solid particles and parasites. Then it goes through reverse osmosis filtration. You've probably heard of that, and that gives us some of the purest water, followed by an activated carbon filter that takes out all the organic solvent chemicals, you know, the pesticides, pollutants, and things that we don't really want. Now, I don't recommend distilled water. That's had too much taken out of it. It sounds pure. But in fact, we rely on our water for a number of minerals and nutrients. It's not good to get rid of everything. But reverse osmosis water is about 99.99%, you know, however many nines you want to add, percent pure. The thing is, it, it tastes really good because it takes out pretty well everything that's going to impact you and your health. And this particular model, as you can see, is a countertop. Uh, it's very easy to use. It's driven by electricity, so you don't have the big... Pr now, the big problem with re reverse osmosis filtration is it takes hours. So, you know, it, once you've drained down the tank that you've got, then you've got to wait maybe till next day for it to fill up again. This, although it's on a small scale, is ideal for drinking water, cooking, uh, making your tea and the coffee and so on. It's very simple to use. Look, all you do is pull out the jug part, that's this bit, fill it full of water, uh, take it to the tap, fill it full of water, and then when you plug it in, uh, you might be able to hear the motor running, what it actually does is work, and using an electric pump actually drives water through the three filters, so it's much quicker. It takes only about 10 minutes to filter, really very pure filter, uh, a typical amount of water that you'd use in the kitchen for half a day or a day. They, these are easy, the filters are easy to service and maintain. When you get one, they'll remind you every so often. The thing has a set life and you don't want it to expire, but they, trust me, their suppliers will let you know. But basically, for the basic usage, uh, a cartridge would last about two years, so it's not something you're going to have to change every few weeks. As with the, the Brita filter, you have to change them frequently, otherwise they do more to contaminate the water supply than purify it. Uh, what it ends up with is a jug here that's full of water, that's been filtered, is pure, is very clean, and you can disconnect that and put it in the fridge so you can keep it chilled as drinking water. It just comes off in a jug like this, okay? Uh, it's ideal, and the, the lid does flip up, trust me. <laughs> Wait a minute, I don't want this to bounce, there we go. Uh, so you can pour it as a jug. I didn't want it to bounce and slop water everywhere, especially not while I'm making this movie. So very, very easy to use, uh, and it's not at all expensive. You know, a reverse osmosis system, if you have it plugged in the sink under the tap, can cost hundreds of dollars, up to a thousand or even more dollars this is just a few hundred i think it's brilliant i've got one as you can see all you do is put the glass under the tap press the button and it'll make you some delicious clean tasting water highly recommended thank you